Today I will be introducing you to this tool. It is called a facial microdermabrasion and actually I didn't know about this much until this company reached out to me and practically what it is is kind of like exfoliating your face or in other terms when you do your nails and they're filing off your nails you know how they take off all that dead skin that's what we're doing with our face but in a gently matter or in a gently way. It comes with four attachments and each one of them do a different function. So here I'm just showing you briefly what each attachment looks like. And also it comes with a little brush so you can clean the instrument. And of course you cannot forget the filters. Do remember that it is important to put the filter in there because you're gonna see all the dead skin at the end yeah kind of yummy right prior to using the instrument I charged it for like about two hours and I just left it there for two hours to be honest with you and I started cooking but anyway that's another story so then I went ahead and turn it on and look at this you see a little face and it tells you okay what part of your face you'll be working on in this case you'll be working uh, with your cheeks and it tells you the level that you prefer to use and also it gives you the timer okay the timer that would be auto mode but you can uh, keep it longer in manual okay that's when you decide when to turn it off also do notice that you do have little arrows that is how you're supposed to use the tool on that area okay I'm back I went ahead and washed my face I have nothing on my skin it's totally washed okay I'm gonna go ahead and use this head right here remember I should say <laughs> let me back up what I'm going to do is to use this attachment right here remember you have different ones depending on what area you want to treat this bigger one is more like for your body so this one would be for the nose area and this one is softer but i'm going to go ahead and use the standard one and you already know that there is a filter now you do have a bunch of filters here if you have them is for a reason so let's go ahead and find out how this works here i'm going to go ahead and start with the auto mode and one of the things that i notice is that yeah there's suction okay that's why you see that's why you see me holding my face on one side because what you want to do is to move that tool back and forth and here i didn't do it and oh. <laughs> that's okay here I need to switch to a smaller one because, yeah, it doesn't fit, but we're gonna do. Telling me here to do the bottom, but I'm not done. I'm gonna put it on manual because I'm not finishing, but since it's the first time I do it, I'm not finishing uh, on time or whatnot. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish up the forehead. So I have it on manual there and the time I'm gonna put it on level two and I'm just gonna press you hear the sound that way I'm done as you can see here it looks a little red not red but you can see that the blood the blood flow was flowing uh, what I'm gonna do I'm gonna continue on this side I'm gonna do my cheeks my forehead and then I'm gonna go ahead and change the attachment so it fits in here and right here and again, I have it on manual. I'm gonna hold. You know what, I was gonna show you how this one got out. And he had like white stuff, I can't. I can't I lost it right now anyway so I could see dead skin on the actual filter okay so after I was done using it I do feel like there is like a white cast 
on my skin and that's practically the dry skin. I do feel my skin a lot softer. Now I'm gonna go ahead and follow with my regular skincare routine. I'm gonna go ahead and apply hydraulic acid. because my skin is super dry. And you know what? Oh my gosh. It's drinking it. Like if it's thirsty, it's gone. You should have to wait a little bit. Hmm. And then I'm going to move on with my vitamin C serum. My vitamin C serum. This one I got from Ulta. I'm going to apply it all over. I'm not sure it's too Okay. And while that is marinating, I'm going to apply my eye cream. This one came in my boxy charm, well now it's see, but that's where I got it from. I'm going to apply it all over my eye area. I have more over here. And once everything is soaking in, then I move on with my moisturizer, which is this one. It's from a drugstore, but it is my favorite one. I've tried many, many more, and I always go back to this one. And I do apply a generous amount. And don't forget the lips, which believe it or not, I put a lot of lip balm and it still my lips are dry as heck. Anyhow, this is my skincare routine. Um, all these serums and creams. Now, do I think this puppy's worth it? Um, I did notice a difference. My skin was softer and on the little filter I noticed like this dry skin residue. So. I would say that if you really do use it, that it will work. But again, this is just my first impression. This is the first time I use it. Will I use it again? Absolutely. I think um, that once I get the hang of it more, I can utilize it in other ways. For example, uh, here, this attachment is for the body. And I just noticed something too. Here, it tells you what each attachment is for. Anyhow, uh, I just wanted to introduce you to, to this type of in beauty instrument. And uh, since we are older and we're trying to keep our skin looking the best we can, um, you know there it is i hope that this helped you in any way or form and like always i will see you next time hasta la vista adios okay i was about to be done filming and i noticed of course all that dead skin on my t-shirt